What is up guys, Tech Rex here. In this video I got an iPhone 7, it's the beautiful matte black finish. And the video I have today for you guys is something that definitely has myself feeling a little triggered. Now, I'm not going to actually open this up, but I will briefly show you guys. What I have here is the world's strongest acid. It is a super acid, and if I can find it in this bag, there it is. I will show you guys. This is called fluoroantimonic acid. It has a pH level of negative 31, and it's supposedly 10 quadrillion times stronger than sulfuric acid. I have 100 grams of it, um, and I will just gently try and pour this on an iPhone 7 and wait it out for 24 hours. I'm not going to try and initially mix it with anything because there's just not enough research shown on this. Uh, I haven't even seen a single YouTube video of this stuff being um, shown you know, as an example or an experiment of some kind. So that's pretty much the bottom line. It's kind of a test video. I'm just going to pour this stuff on the iPhone 7. We'll see what happens. Let's get straight into this. Now, at first glance, I'm not sure why, but this looks like there's crystals everywhere inside here. So it doesn't seem like it's in a pure liquid state. I can see crystals everywhere. And I don't really even feel it moving around, but let's go ahead and open it. As you guys can see, the way they sealed this up makes it very hard to open because there's like some sort of rubber on the tape. Okay guys, one more time, here is the iPhone 7 and I'm actually going to flip it over. I've opened up the bottle and I'm gonna make sure and pour it on the back first, but the phone will be on. So we'll see if it's still on tomorrow. And finally guys, let's go ahead and take this it's literally crystals what in the world with a little bit of liquid okay guys so there's still a lot more in here I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna leave uh, some of it on the iPhone 7 on the back of the iPhone and then close the cap and put some more in the morning so we'll see how it goes from there check this out here is the iPhone 7 just around 12 hours later this looks like it came from another planet you could see some of the crystals are still on the iPhone but I mean there's various things that's crossing my mind first of all I heard this this stuff dissolves through glass and everything um, and I could see how it's dissolving, but I was actually thinking it would be, you know, almost like instant. You know, I wasn't expecting it to be hot right off the bottle, but you can tell right now it's definitely doing its job. So now I'm going to go ahead and pour just a couple drops of hydrogen peroxide into the container just to see if anything happens. Still super shocked to know that nothing happened to that lithium ion battery that's active in that iPhone 7. Same beige color, sulfuric acid mixed with fluoroantimonic acid. Now the final moment of truth guys, we're going to find out if this, what once was the matte black iPhone 7 can boot up if I charge it. I washed it off, I still don't really want to touch it, I'm going to plug this in because I know the battery died that's for for a fact it's plugged in is it completely broken though and I don't see any signs of life Let's see if I 
holding the power button. No. No way. No way, no way. I'm seeing, guys. I am not joking. There is a battery symbol. It's telling me to charge it up. This is very hard to see. I can barely see this myself. Check that out. The Apple logo is shining. The phone has booted up 3%. 2.45 p.m. No SIM card installed. You guys can see even part of the display of the glass is uh, was starting to get eaten away just by how it looks like. I mean, this isn't any grease. This isn't grease or residue right here. This is just part of the glass that started getting deteriorated. So you can tell, you know, if this was would be submerged for maybe a week, this phone would definitely die completely. But I mean, oh my goodness, this phone is in working order from the most corrosive acid on the planet. That is incredible, guys. And I, I'm loving that new Spider-Man design now. Like, this thing was once black, and now it's just black and white. And you can't clean any more of this, but it's polished. It's looking beautiful. The phone is working. Everything is perfectly fine. That is so crazy. Look at this touch sensitivity. Volume rockers go up and down. Let's test some of the sound options. Sound. Just to see if the ringtones. Look at that. Everything works perfectly fine. Guys, thanks for watching. That is incredible. I'm impressed. As always, stay tuned for more videos. And peace out.